Voulez-vous bake macarons avec moi ce soir? Uh, today it's the Saturday before Valentine's Day, and this is when we're gonna do all of our festivities. And what that is going to entail, <clears throat> excuse me, is I'm baking French macarons, um, which is gonna be my gift for Amanda. Uh, I only do this like once a year. So every time I do it, I'm like, oh no, do I remember what I'm doing? Since it's a complicated process, it can be a little, um, a little nerve wracking. And a word to the wise, if ever you start baking macarons, take my advice. Be very careful about who you tell that you bake macarons and be very careful who you share it with because otherwise you'll have all these people once they find out crawling out of woodworks oh when are you gonna make macarons again when are you gonna make macarons again when are you gonna make macarons again and you know what they're, they're fun to make but like it's, it's a labor of love and every time I hear that I want to be like the more you ask that the less I want to do it. So be careful. Um, but no, I, I love doing it like for the people I care about. It's just like my neighbors and stuff bugging me that I'm like, Ugh. but anyways, that's the big thing. Oh, and they're going to be filled with, with lemon curd. Um, and then if there's leftover lemon curd, I'm also going to give that to Amanda. I think I said before she breaks for lemon curd, but I don't, I mean, I like it, but I don't really break for it. Um, so I'm gonna give her the leftovers. And that might be it for the vlog, but then when she comes over, um, we're gonna make really epic macaroni and cheese and, and drink Prosecco. So macarons and macaroni and cheese and sparkling wine, which sounds totally bizarre, but I think that kind of sums up us. <laughs> Are those stiff peaks, or are you just happy to see me? My meringue is done. Let's see. Like, yep. I think it's happy to see me. Ready to fold in the dry stuff. Okay, right now I've got this delightful pink goo. I think. I think this is what it's supposed to look like, but like I said, I. I only do this about once a year, so we'll see if try piping it out and hope for the best. All right, well, the hideously piped, but we're still gonna see how this goes, and I'm gonna try this one-handed. But here's my favorite part. Actually, no, I can't do this one-handed, but my favorite part is banging it on the counter. I actually lied. This is my favorite part, licking the spoon. Mmm, spoon. So, um, while my macarons are resting before I can put them in the oven, I'm just gonna show a little more cosplay progress. I just did another mock-up. I it's not, still not 100% there, but I think this might be my final mock-up. Um, the, there are still changes I wanna do, but they're small enough changes I have a good enough idea of how to accomplish them that I, I don't think I'm, I need to go ahead and make another mock-up to know how I want to proceed with the real fabric, but I'm not sure. I'm just going to sit on it and think about it and get back to cleaning up the giant mess I made in the kitchen. Still resting the macarons, but here's what we're drinking tonight. I feel like I've tried this one before, but it was a long time ago and I don't remember, but I like Prosecco. And it's the Cupcake Vineyards. The name always weirded me out until I actually tried it because I don't like sweet wine. So I was like, what is this? Cupcake wine? Oh, I like it though. Well, I messed up a little bit. I put them way too close together and some of them are really getting to know each other very well, but we'll, we'll figure something out. Um, maybe the ugly ones can go to my, my neighbors. So they're all right. Rustic. Oh my god. Welcome to today's edition of Gan, what in the hell kind of crazy thing are you doing now? Yes, this is egg yolk on my face. Um, I was just 
I'm just waiting for the macarons to cool and trying to look up stuff that I could do with the leftover egg yolks and red one where it says it's good for your skin, so I don't know. Right now it's just nasty and cold, but we'll we'll see if it did anything. Uh, I think maybe there was kind of something to that putting egg yolk on the face because um, it was a little bit moisturizing, but anyways, I have a confession. Every time I said that something was my favorite part, I was lying because right here, this is my favorite part. And as you can kind of see, they're rustic. Um, they, they, since they all smushed together, since I don't know how to pipe things at all, they all smushed together. I tried to separate them. There was a lot of breaking and cracking, but I think I ended up with enough less hideous ones to give to Amanda and the nasty ones I guess I could eat myself or give away so macaron with lemon curd in it oh and the lemon curd turned out fantastic so you know if she's hope she loves lemon curd so hopefully she won't be upset over having ugly macarons but let's see how it goes mmm okay I screwed up some other stuff. The texture is all wrong and the lemon curd doesn't work because it just oozed right out, but E for effort. That's probably gonna be it for this. I have to clean that up. It's probably gonna be it for this time. Um, have fun and be safe.